what's up you guys welcome back today for all my new subscribers that don't know i actually sometimes would do reaction videos to some drum covers that i actually did and today is one of those videos and i just want to point out a few things that i did in this drum cover by all means if you guys want to see the original video it'll be down in the description box below and uh yeah so i want to start off by like letting you guys hear once again the way that J-Rod approached this intro to this track, all right? Okay, okay, so keep that in mind because like when I was practicing this, I wanted to like, I wanted to mess around with the timing of even the intro. So I wanted to, I wanted to feel completely different. I wanted it to uh, like just come in at a completely different time and stuff like that. And it, it, it worked out perfectly. This took about like maybe 20 tries to get this down, but uh, I'm glad, I'm glad it came out right. Remember the intro? Flipped it. <laughs> Just pay attention to how the guitar comes in now because of this change. go back real quick this right here this is like a little cheat code i think i, I broke this down on instagram and i um when we were me and zach were at sweetwater i actually showed him this and he put he applied it in between his drum licks Woo! That, that that was crazy i wish i wish somebody was recording that but um yeah it's like this little quick thing that i do it's a kick right right left your right hand is going on the toms and your left hand stays on the snare you can put that in between your licks before it to start it or even to end it and just throwing it in it, it's it just it adds something completely different you're gonna notice it throughout this solo
didn't know that I actually did that. That little thing what I did with the cowbell, w- bro. Okay, and I noticed, like, in the moment, I knew, I'm like, whoa, that sound pretty decent. And then I, I did my best, and I actually succeeded on repeating it. And it's crazy how when you repeat any licks that you know how to do and stuff like that, if you repeat it, like, once or twice or even three times, it just it turns it into a completely different lick to uh, people's ears. And it just, it's dope. It's, it's a dope little thing. Which I did a third time. Y'all catch it? Y'all catch it? Kick right, right, left. That I just stole. I just snuck it in. Oh, well, I'm in. There you go. <laughs> oh, yep. This right here, I wanted to talk about real quick. This lick right here. Okay, so let me say this publicly. I am getting tons of comments and. uh DMs and stuff like that about how like yo I saw you with the with the Eric Moore lick. Let me say this publicly. I did not learn this lick from Eric Moore. I actually seen this lick done years ago. If you guys um were subscribed at the time, I reacted to my bro Carlo. He was playing Celebrate the King. This man did that lick from the uh the second rack time to the floor time that's the first time i ever seen it done like that and i'm like whoa wait and i i spent hours trying to learn this like from that video actually i got i got the clip oh! all right so yeah that's where i got it from but uh yeah let me go back to the beginning of this solo I'm gonna stop talking. Guys, that's it for today's video make sure also i'll leave this in screen after the end of this video if you guys haven't checked out j rides uh take on this track highly recommend it like he went off and um uh, yeah if you're new we are on our way to 190k and like 200k is right around the corner man right around the corner shout out to everybody that's been showing so much love on my youtube shorts I'm gonna be doing a whole lot more of those. There's a lot of crazy tracks that I have that are literally one minute long, so I can definitely do those as shorts. And uh, yeah, keep showing the love on the shorts and keep showing love on these videos. I really appreciate all the support. If you guys want my ebook, links down in the description box below. Chops like that are in that book. So um, yeah, I highly recommend you guys check that out. Make sure to grab you guys some merch at joshdrumclass.com. Those links are down in the description box below. Also, um, yeah, 
and if you guys want this track and along with other tracks from shared tracks their link is down in the description box also everything is down there so make sure to check that stuff out and uh yeah i will see you guys next time make sure to follow me on instagram and um yeah and let me know down in the comments below if there's any other drum covers that i did in the past that you want me to react to and sort of like tell you where my head was at during that time of the video and stuff like that uh yeah let me know